I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on vectors. Here is a very important question on vectors where we are going to understand some basic operations. The question here is, in a regular hexagon A, B, C, D, E, F, write the vector C, D in terms of vectors A, B and B, C. You can always pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. So let's begin by sketching a hexagon first, right? So let's say this is the hexagon. Okay. And let's label it. You can start from anywhere you want. So we can say A, B, C, D, E, and F. A regular hexagon means all sides are equal, all angles are equal right so opposite sides will be kind of parallel so we have three sets of uh, parallel opposite sides now the question here is that we are given the vectors a b that is our vector a b and then we have a vector b c what we need to find is how can we write the vector c d which is this vector in terms of these two vectors correct so that is the question for you so i hope now the question is absolutely clear you can pause the video answer the question and then look into my suggestions now there are a few important concepts which i would like to recall before getting into the solution right so so from here let's try to sketch let me just draw the diagonals here right and uh, you know that is how you may get when you draw the diagonals they will all go through the center right now in this particular case when we are seeing vector a b in that case this vector is also equal to a b right let us say o is the center is it okay so what we get here is that vector OC is also equal to vector AB, correct? So it is important to note that vectors are equal if they have same direction and same magnitude, right? So this magnitude is exactly same. You can see this it forms a parallelogram and therefore the vector OC is equal to vector AB. Now, similarly, from this construction, you can see that OD is same as BC, right? So, so we get O to D is actually equal to B to C, correct? So, so in vectors, you can actually move your vectors from one place to another, locate them somewhere which just helps you to solve the question. And now we need to figure out what is C to D, right? That is what we want. So, well, you can say OA, I mean O to C, let me write this as O to C plus C to D is equal to O to D, right? You could write like this. And then O and then C to D, this vector C to D will be equal to OD minus OC, correct? Now, OD, we just figured out, is same as BC. So, we could write this as BC and OC is same as AB, right? So, it is AB. So, we get that the CD vector is back, is basically equal to BC minus AC. You get the idea. So in this particular case, we have shown that the vector CD is basically equal to vector BC minus AB. So by using, by translating the vectors, we can easily solve such questions. I hope this concept helps you to solve similar questions. 
So note this construction which we made here, drawing these diagonals. We actually got a diagonal and from that diagonal, which was parallel to the opposite side, we worked out. Right? So if you use this concept in this hexagon, you can find any vector. Right? So now the question for you is, write vector BE in terms of vector AB and BC. So that is your question now. I hope that helps. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.